but me nangenga ashu ngatai kuna bantu baringa umuntu akona mayikuluma uyamuza utama nomuntu yakuluma lo english yake ipuma ngamakhala ngathi 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 can you please borrow me your english ukuthi nama ngiya kuma interview kube ngathi ngiya icava lentengi yiringa kahle kahle eh abanye abantu bayakwazi ukukhuluma but if flop la ku tiktok if flop la ku tiktok most of them speak nonsense bo mama are you being realistic mara kahle kahle now my expectations were i'm just talking from an expectations point of view when you look when you look at yourself what you like mean i need a guy like this are you being realistic number one, if you say when us shaying a millionaire are you in close proximity na ma millionaires how many millionaires do you know i kifuna indote zongnikeza 2000 a month allowance normal 10000 a month allowance your current circumstances your current surroundings are they real to your ambition do they align when you look at yourself do you see yourself with a guy who earns over 250000 a month who is able to give you that allowance when you are being real with yourself and this is the very important questions that as a woman i think you should be asking yourself ukuthi at the current state of affairs right now my life ukho nomjide ngathi ngamfonela khona jwano ngithi i'm short ng10000 i need it urgently agayelo 10000 ukhona nyabuza there's a few of you that can say yes but i know for a fact ukuthi over a million or even 10 million ladies have never received even a 5000 allowance from umjita there's only a few there's only a few bunze imalanga bank so when you look at your ambitions and your expectations you need to be real with your circumstances your current surroundings your movements your circles you need to consider all those things and be realistic with yourself say you abona le nto ngiyai funa as a as a person i desire these things but realistic speaking it's highly unlikely for me to lend a soccer star because you don't frequent around soccer stars i need to bump so i'm listening to this lady in german it's like kahle kahle come band lass ukuluma nge dating pool in german dating pool is not the problem if flop who my sister the way you think the way your expectations are set up it doesn't it doesn't make sense and i wonder how many other ladies are thinking the same way i mean we are born now in eka slack ukuthi amajita ya struggle so bayagereza amajita there's only a few that are making it that guy or your tolly certificate the it no me degree you buy developer then there only a few we are cover now ukuthi amajita se eka slack abanayo leyo nyo so why the hell would you think ukuthi there would be a random guy somewhere who's making a million rent and wants to give it to you ngoba when unani oh no i i think i deserve it. of course everybody thinks deserves the best of the world but are you being real listen to this is a boy chris 3k why is he making 5k what am i gonna do 5k on a vacation so and i i honestly do understand like we haven't invested match into each other we've only been like on two dates we had only been on two dates um and he really was putting in an effort you know on our dates about like vintage wine um came with flowers picked me up we were black you know he was being like a gentleman until the moment i was for pocket <laughs> and he sent me 5k it ruined the whole experience for me because I was like I come from a relationship where I was treated well at this point I feel like she should have stayed at that relationship where she was treated well but the question is why did she leave or how did that relationship where she was treated well end because I mean at this point now we are stuck with a broken record that will constantly tell us about how she was treated well at the previous relationship
Hello, I'm Zanti. Welcome back to our channel. In today's video, we're doing TikTok reactions. And this is about a $5,000 rand pocket money that she didn't like. Let's listen to the rest of the video because it is absolutely hilarious. I didn't want to chop it all up because I have been laughing and decided this is a great video. Let me share it with my subscribers. So comment below. Let me know your thoughts below. You know what? I don't normally like to give my opinion, but I'm definitely tame. I agree with most of the stuff that he's saying because it absolutely makes no sense what this girl is saying. Why is she out of the other relationship? And if you see the original video, you do see the child. But let me stop talking. Let me let you listen to the rest of what he has to say. Thanks for watching. After she was offered or she was given 5,000 rands, and this ungrateful witch has the audacity to come on social media and say, I was expecting 100 times more. By the way, 100,000, 100 times more means that she was expecting half a million from a random guy who barely knows her, who's courting her, taking her out on two dates. And this guy, for some reason, because he wants her, he must pay. He must show through the pocket that he deserves her. What hogwash nonsense is that? Maranina, abanyena sklanye nagasega. How dare you expect a guy who's taken you on two dates to give you more than 5,000 rand? This guy was generous, by the way. How many of you, that most of you ladies, have never received even a thousand rands from Amajit? This one got 5,000, and here she is ramping around on social media as an ungrateful witch, Ugutiena. She was expecting more. And the audacity to say the guy went to Paris. So what? You expected the guy to hold his life from going to Paris and take that money, give it to you because you are deserving. Deprive himself a game, a rabbi, a France, and take that money, give it to you because you are so entitled. But can you see with Amachi that I have to deal with what, Bosis? This is the kind of things Amachita need to deal with. Now, a guy needs to compete with the ghost other guy that was probably doing Amakesh in transit or who was a tenderpreneur who was able to make millions and millions and millions and millions of money. Now, the new guy needs to compete with that guy. For what? If that relationship was good for her and she was treated well, why did she leave that relationship to become a single mother so that she can actually find another guy? It means that relationship wasn't good for her. First of all, the lady is coming from maternity. What, what? Because I listen to her on a new policy, but I look profile. I go born with the law. I long at it. Accept the law. Figure the lamb shabin. She go today. It wasn't voluntarily for her to be out of the dating pool. She came out of the dating pool because she was pregnant and nursing her child. It wasn't voluntarily. But where is the father of the child? It already it's giving. Unstable witch, because I mean, the child is still fresh. Where is that guy who was treating you well? You can't keep a man, and we all know why you can't keep a man because you're an unrealistic person, you have got ridiculous expectations of people you just met. You you seem to be a person on a Zazu to Funan and Pilwin. And no guy would want to settle with a person who's narrow-minded such as you. I feel like the guy has dodged the bullet. I mean, he saved his life. There's a girl out there who's going to be grateful even for a 500 rand. I mean, if Kala went a 5,000, you can get a 350 Muna Ucheri, Otola 500 rand from Umchita every month, and they are so grateful. They are more grateful than you are. And don't come here and speak about Ama standards. You must have standards with your own money. You can't come here and have standards. You can't come here and have standards. You can't be coming on social media and blab nonsense like this. What are you trying to say? You are trying to, to create a perception that the guy is a loser. He is not the loser. You are the loser. Because you are expecting ridiculous things from random people who want to date you. The guy probably thought, hey, this is a good lady. I want to see if I can have a future with her. got to rejected by any, by many other guys before him. Many other guys rejected you. And then this guy must come and settle with an idiot such as yourself. Imprudent lady. Ah, come on. 
this is ridiculous. Any lady who thinks this is the way to go, this is the way that things should be done, this is nonsense. You can't be doing these things. You can't be thinking like this. It's ridiculous. The dating pool has changed. Dating pool, you know, the dating pool is not the problem. You are the problem. You need to fix yourself. Kunin in Lock and City, yo. This man, standing ovation, said it so well. Why are our brothers, our uncles, our sons, why should they be put through this rigmarole? This, what did he call it? Delusional witch. He doesn't even bother with saying Slay Queen. He calls her a witch. And no, I have to clap hands for this guy. I think he spoke. He spoke for a lot of people. And I know that there's going to be people and in the comments who are going to say, no, he's wrong. She's right. She deserves more than $5,000. Think about it. She said she needed she a needed 100 times. So 100 times 500 is 500,000. She needed 500,000 in pocket money. Not even Mihlali has come on the internet to say that. Maybe Beyonce from Jay-Z. But Beyonce, even if Jay-Z gave her 500,000, Beyonce can make 500,000 in a minute. But we're talking about a slay queen. Um, and, you know, I could be wrong, but she, she reminds me so much of the other lady whose TikTok starts with Welcome to another day of a single girlfriend, something like that. No. Welcome to another day as a unemployed girlfriend. Some Oh, welcome to another day as a stay at home girlfriend. That something about their personalities um not even personalities, the way they look is so similar because in the beginning I thought it was her. But I realized it's not her because um a day in the life of day in the life of a stay at home girlfriend does not have a child. And this lady has a child and the child gangane gangane we as are there on the TikTok where the mother be talking about I'm going to a neighboring country. Why did she not want to name the country? Where are you going? Is it Botswana, Zimbabwe, Mozambique, Malawi? Where are you going and why does it remain such an un unnamed um, location? I mean, after all, you do need pocket money to get there or to have a great time there since you managed to raise the funds to pay for the tickets and everything. He's right. This is our TikTok reaction. I think I'm going to actually start doing a series of this because this is hilarious. This TikTok was hilarious and you should see she actually put her account on private she couldn't take the heat you came on the internet that's the problem with social media you came on the internet unsolicited unprovoked well provoked because he went to france to watch the rugby and i guess we can blame sia and team the springboks team for winning the world cup because now Ukiel is catching feelings that this guy didn't give a pocket money but um, pocket money to her standard but he could take himself to go watch the rugby match and she's got problems with that and she's putting it out on the internet but hi your thoughts in the comment section down below is she entitled to five hundred thousand in pocket money thanks for watching remember to do the things that help our channel grow we're on our way to fifteen thousand subscribers can't wait to get there so make sure you uh, subscribe to the channel like this video share it to your whatsapp group this could help a brother an uncle or even um a, your son so make sure to share this video so they hear what's happening in the dating pool what women's expectations are and 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 thanks so much for watching enjoy your weekend mm -hmm.